Previously, we explored the beaches of Numia, dove the crystal clear waters of Dumbia Pass, and weathered a passing front. So we are in Bay de Sainte Marie and we have blue skies after what was a fairly yucky morning of squally winds but as you can see sprouts sitting pretty down there we just thought we'd get out of the boat after working on videos all day so when in France listen to rap music <laughs> <laughs> So we're um, going to meet Nico, who um, we met in the surf yesterday, um, and he said, come and do your washing or do whatever you want, coolest guy ever. Um, and we're using an app called Ovital Map, which um, it's uh, like Google Maps, but you can store all of the maps um, when you've got internet, and then when you don't, like now, you've still got your maps. Um, you can see we're here, and I know his house is up here. And so we're just cruising through New Mia with the maps offline. We got messages. Bonjour. <laughs> Bonjour. Making friends. What are you doing? At the moment I'm looking at Windy TY and we're uh, uploading some vids. And uh, Sprout's just there, so I can watch the boat, which is pretty wicked. So, um, thanks, Nico. Thanks, Nico. I've just basted Jesse's two sourdough loaves. So we've got a baguette and a lovely loaf of bread. We're probably an hour from Matu, Ilamatu, uh, which is like a little atoll with an island. And I am pretty excited to eat this bread when we get in. So Jesse's doing some exercise outside and we're motoring because there's zero wind, which means it's nice and flat made some water, made some bread, we're all sorted. <laughs> reef on one side, reef, 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 pass, reef, 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 hill. Time at the moment, so we're gonna just do some uh, fish identifying. We've got the, uh, the eel guide. So uh, we're gonna just cruise around the reefs and, and suss out some good diving spots for tomorrow. See your feet below your knees. The Buddha Valley. In a minute, you'll be hungry again. Glassy today. This is just doing some laps. I just gave him a haircut, had a wash of his hair, 
pretty much just a big pool. What a day! <laughs> that's um, uh, Mato Island, and there's a track up up to the top of the hill. But there's, well, we haven't seen any sneeze snakes here. Apparently, there's a few. Claire doesn't like sneeze snakes. out of the wind where um well I'm up at uh, the top of Mardo. Um pretty uh, steep old climb to get up here. Claire decided that the uh, snake likelihood was uh, too high so she called it quits but uh, it's okay. I think it's uh, I think it's worth it. Old uh, bear on the beach doing the uh, combing of the beach. Beach combing going on down there. So we have just left Ile Mato or Matu. Um, we spent four days there, it was really nice, like apparently we are quite lucky to get four days of good weather to stay there. Um, we're now heading into Bay de Pruni, I think we're going to go to Casey Island first if we can pick up a mooring. Um, there's heaps of really fragile coral throughout the whole bay so um, it's, although it's really protected from the weather, it's quite tricky to um, anchor in. So there is a few national park moorings. Um, that you have to try and get uh, to protect the, the coral and conserve that. Uh, it's a pretty nice day, no wind while well, there is, but uh, it's, we're going directly down with it, so it's like the one knot of a parrot. And we'll, yeah, we've had a lovely time. So, we'll probably stay in Bay Prony for a few days and explore all of the little. Um, Hot springs, ruins. I'm really excited to meet Moose, who's the dog that lives on KC. And yeah, can't wait. Previously, we explored the beaches of Numia. Beaches. Beaches. Why do you do that? You gotta stretch your mouth.